Yo guys, today I'm going to be showing you the top five things that make your bike a wheelie bike. So yeah, let's get into it. So, the first one, a back brake. I bought a Shimano back brake. I think they're really good. Um, they go from about £20. Um, you can spend over £200 on a brake, but I wouldn't really recommend it because um, it's a bit of waste of money. And you could buy these, all of these things for about £70, which make your bike a wheelie bike. Um, yeah, they aren't, they're just a oil back brake that is much sharper than a, a wire and just more resistant. Um, they are disc back brakes, not pads. You can get pad ones, but I recommend discs because they're a bit better. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Let's move on to the next one. Um, grips, handlebar grips. Handlebar grips, they're good, but um, I do recommend ODIs or DMRs. Um, they are very cheap and also they last for ages. I've had them on my bike, I had them on my previous bike as well. They're still good. So yeah, I recommend them. They go for about 10 pound, so it's not that expensive. Um, they're very reliable and they're just all in all a good grip. Um, you can get all different colours, you can get pink, blue, red, purple, green, loads. You can get any colour you want. Um, and also they come with bar ends but that doesn't really matter because uh, you don't have to put them in. Um, next one is um, pedals. Pedals don't really matter unless you've got rubbish grip on your pedals. And I do recommend um, DMR pedals uh, because they're just a good pedal. Lots of people use them for MTB and stuff like that and wheelies. So, um, and they roundabout go for about, max you can probably buy them for about £30. So it's not that expensive. But you can get all the colours you want, as I said, with the grips. Um, that's really it about the uh, pedals. Um, they, I would recommend getting metal ones because um, plastic ones, when you fall, if you do fall, then you might break, they might snap. So that's why I recommend metal ones. Um, next thing is spoke covers. Spoke covers, you can get any colour you want. They're on eBay for about one pound, one pound fifty. Um, I won't go too crazy on the money with spokes because they're not worth 20 quid, something like that. You can get any colour you want, just look, just type up spoke covers, it'll come up on eBay. The max money you spend is probably like fiver. That's not that much for spoke covers and they do look, make your bike look cool. You can get reflective ones as well. Um, they're quite smaller, so but depends what size you want. Um, yeah, so the next thing is a seat. A seat is quite important. One, to make your bike look good, and two, for grip. Grip is um, key, because if you are wheeling, you go behind your balance point, and you pull your back brake, you might fall off the back, because it's slippery. So I recommend Mafia or SE. If you don't want to spend that much money, I recommend Mafia, because um, one, they are grippy, two, they look good, and three, they're not expensive. They're about 25 pound. SD, if you want to spend an extra 20 quid, they're about £45. And you can get any colour you want, so um, just put in Mafia or SC seats and it will come up. All you have to do is just click on it and then order it if you want to. Um, they're not hard to put on either, all you have to do is undo the bolt at the bottom and then just put it on. If you want to tilt it, you just have to pull your seat forward a bit. But yeah, that's all really. So. And all this goes underneath 70 quid, so you don't have to spend lots of money on your bike if you just bought a brand new bike. Um, yeah, it's they're all reliable, especially the grips, pedals, bars, uh, not bars, seats. Um, yeah, that's about it for me, so see you in the next one. Like and subscribe. <laughs>